we've set up a safari operation. It's a photographic safari, so no hunting or anything like that. So we have four camps. Tafika here is six chalets. And basically our theme for all our operation is to use natural materials and local skills to build them. So it means that everything is rebuilt every year. So all the villages are involved. We've added $10 to our daily rate. $5 goes straight towards our Tofika fund and $5 to conservations. We've at least had a more steady inflow for our fund. Lovely female herd well, They were about to drop their young in November. In a month's time, they'll all have young. It's a magical time. It's a baby in parlors everywhere. There are endless children asking for support. Originally it just started with people donating funds, paying teachers for the school. And then it kind of developed from there. After that we took the top students and we gave them scholarships, so we paid for everything there. Transport, their, all equipment, uniforms, fees, etc. Altogether our students are about, vary between about 25 to 30 students that we support every year. Since our program has been operating, hope is one thing that I do see blossoming more and more. The fact that these children can see they have a possibility of another way of life as they become more and more educated and have more options, you can see them having more and more presence. That's one of the most exciting parts of it, just watching children grow up and be confident. I think the small things are the things that are the most effective. You just do what's needed today and somehow tomorrow you're one step ahead. <laughs>